Welcome back. So how is Bakersfield doing compared to other US cities in the recovery from the COVID-19 pandemic? Turns out better than you might expect. 17's Robert Price explains why. You don't often hear Las Vegas and Bakersfield in the same sentence, but when it comes to recovering from the COVID-19 pandemic and its effect on business, Bakersfield is right up there. And the Nile Theater is one of the many reasons why. Right up there at number two in the national rankings, right behind Sin City, which based on unusual criteria, cell tower traffic in its urban core is actually more active, more energetic, and presumably more prosperous than it was prior to the pandemic. Bakersfield is next, according to the latest version of a study by the University of Toronto, an update to what we've reported before. Bakersfield has 90% of the downtown business activity it had right before the shutdown, followed by El Paso, Texas, Wichita, Kansas, and Oklahoma City. For every winning city, there has to be losers, and in this case, it's Minneapolis, Seattle, and St. Louis, which showed the slowest post-COVID recovery of their downtown cores of all the cities studied. The bottom five have roughly half the downtown activity these days that they had in 2019. If Bakersfield seems an unlikely winner, given the many problems its downtown has suffered in recent years, from homelessness and vandalism to abandoned buildings and absentee owners, but Andre Gonzalez, who is, in effect, the city's downtown councilman, says the bad is not enough to weigh down the overall good. Despite all of those things, we still see an incremental uh, increase in the number of people coming downtown to open businesses, to shop, to visit. Uh, we see downtown as an entertainment venue for the city. And all of these, all of these things work in our favor uh, for the continued revitalization of our urban core. Led by fine dining restaurants, restaurants like Zama, as well as the refurbished Nile Theater, now a music venue, and Rooster's Honky Tonk, a Bakersfield Sound throwback that has helped clean up the sometimes troubled corner of 19th and I. The comeback is on. Sorry, Minneapolis. Hang in there, St. Louis. At the Nile Theater, Robert Price, 17 News.